Hey guys, what's going on? Good afternoon from Dhaka, Bangladesh. Today I want to do two videos for you. One is a comparison video, other one is going to be a full-on review. So uh, these are both uh, going to be again uh, concerning niche fragrance houses, but I think these are kind of uh, at least the comparison video there I'm going to discuss two very popular fragrances. But uh, let me review the Amouage first, the full-on review. This is a uh, Portrayal Man. And I did cover about a week back or so, about 10 days back, I think I covered Portrayal Women. Uh, that one was a very nice fragrance. I really liked it. But this one right here, it's for men, okay? And that's the sample of 2ml. Uh, this fragrance, I think, was not released very long ago. I think this was released, like, uh, recently or not uh, many years back. So the bottle is really nice. I'll put a picture. Uh, I don't have it here. It's only the sample. So these are 2ml official samples. I bought something recent times. I think I bought the Carlyle. And I asked Perfume Bangladesh to send me a sample. And they sent me this one, okay? So this is a very interesting, this is very daring and gutsy fragrance, okay? Uh, if you have been a fan of Amouage, you know a few things for a fact. Amouage does not copy anybody. Their fragrances are different from each other. The bottles, they look different from each other. Only recently they released, I think, uh, Interlude Black Iris. That is first flanker, I think, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not a super knowledgeable guy on Amouage. And it's basically owned by Sultan of Oman, you know? They own this uh, house. This is a royal house okay and these fragrances come with very beautiful bottles if you haven't seen any of them like let me show you uh they come with like this kind of bottle different coloration and then the newer ones uh, i mean they will have a magnetic top okay very nice touch they'll have a source key gemstone and very nice uh, heavy cap really nice bottles i think they have a 50 and 100 ml bottle sizes but portrayal man i think uh, is you see the bottle google it you'll see so this is one fragrance um i am not sure if I'm gonna buy a full bottle or not, let me tell you how I feel about it. So I have it on my hand for a very long time, about one hour. So I reached the dry down. So this is a very, very, very gutsy fragrance. So like most Amouage, you will hardly find anything that's safe. You know, like Parfum de Marly now, they're playing safe. They're going for some safe fragrances. Mansara, they're doing the same. Uh, many other niche houses going towards the, towards the safe direction. Amouage says, screw with that. I'm gonna stick to my own uh, gutsy way and Full, full respect you have to respect them you like it or do not like it but you have to respect them and I think this fragrance is a statement of its own if you you guys know like this fragrance many people say it has that violet like old school uh, some reviewers said it smells like a little bit like Fahrenheit like the oil uh, the, the, the leather and the violets this one has plenty of that okay but I don't think it's a clone or inspired by uh, Fahrenheit because the opening I get let me spray this a little bit I really like the samples okay they comes with cap and then really nice they have all the detailing very high class atomizers even the basic ones the basic 2ml juice they give you quality so let's go okay that's a big spray i don't want to spray too much because this is a very strong fragrance even from a small sample that one spray will last me six seven hours that's the performance so every time i wear this i wear it three days and i think i got six seven hours constantly after that i can smell the dry down but on the high heat situation from a small sample that's already saying something so the thing is i like the opening it has really nice like a fresh it almost reminds me of fahrenheit you know i'll tell you it almost reminds me of fahrenheit fahrenheit is a little bit more more royal yeah it's uh fahrenheit is a little bit more the gasoline you know that violet gives you the gasoline feel it has leather it has woody it has florals sort of like a very nice mix this one okay this is a masterpiece no doubt so on the opening you'll find some similarity with Fahrenheit I would say it's a sweeter uh, more polished less rugged less uh, uh, of a scary opening than Fahrenheit for me but when it starts drying down it becomes starts becoming animal it starts becoming animalistic and that's what I really enjoy about this is a perfect cold weather scent okay portrayal man I don't see anybody wearing this in the high heat but Fahrenheit you can Fahrenheit lasts all year round it's a cold weather scent but in the high heat it also works okay summertime I can wear it with great performance but uh, Dior's Fahrenheit it's more versatile than this uh, longevity wise this one is longer lasting than Fahrenheit it will last you I think if you spray for the main bottle my best guess is it will last you well over 10 hours okay and the opening you might think like oh such a beautiful opening and then after half an hour be like oh no mistake I bought the whole bottle what do I do with it now <laughs> so you really have to check out when you try it in a counter uh, then walk around for one hour then see if you like the dry down that's when you buy this if you like it I think this fragrance will be for 
certain crowd who love violet note a lot and then leather this one is not all about the leather you know i think they describe it as 1920s bohemian culture a woody leather fragrance uh, yeah this is like a fragrance of authority so yeah i can definitely see it it's a bit like when fahrenheit era was on like back in the time this one was a big culture i can see this is a big little bit different you know it has that leather it's rugged but it's very high class so i think you should wear this with a suit or a jacket in cold weathers it will entertain you but it offers a little bit less sweetness it is not as sweet as many other like lyric man is sweet with the rose or uh, reflection is sweet with the lavender this does not provide you sweet or citrus the opening is a little bit uh, tangy i think a bit of citrus up there but that's about it that goes away after 15 20 minutes so this is for mature crowd okay i don't see this wearing i don't see this young folks if you like fahrenheit you can definitely like it think of it as a i don't want to say it but sort of like a niche version of fahrenheit um, you can say so but it's different enough from fahrenheit they are different from each other on the dry down definitely different so the leather is the main player and then i think that woodiness little bit woody but it's a what you call the violets and leather these are the two combinations that i get maybe a little bit floral somewhere i don't know maybe immortal something boozy i don't know it smells a little bit like sunshine man what the sunshine man offers on dry down it has a little bit of elements really nice fragrance but not for all okay sadly not for all uh, it will be a love it or hate it kind of fragrance very 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 uh, polarizing scent but it's a nice creation okay so i prefer the women's one that is more safer this one you should get a sample like this and check for yourself finish the twemo and then you will know if you want a full bottle or not okay so overall this fragrance for what it is uh, uh, i like it a lot 8.5 out of 10 for performance this is 10 okay but overall i'll give it 8.5 because of lack of uh, versatility i don't think you should wear this in high heat and second of all this the smell of it it's kind of like you really have to have a taste for this kind of fragrance it's not going to be everybody's cup of tea like ultra male you know chanel alirom sport always cream i like it those people are gonna love this some people like some people love some people hate also all right so 8.5 for me uh, this is moh portrayal man thanks for watching now move on to the second video of the day which is gonna be a comparison video take care bye bye